Confidence is a result of trial and error. Out of repeating an activity over and over again, it is something that often comes out of failure. A natural part of the learning process. And an opportunity to grow and improve. Taking risks is in fact an important aspect of building. Confidence. Confident Confidence. women have one thing in common. They believe in themselves dot no matter what challenges they face. They know that they have the strength and capability to overcome them. They don't doubt their ability to succeed. And this allows them to take risks and go after their dreams. If you want to be a confident woman, take up space. They aren't afraid to stand out or be heard. One way to start doing this is by making sure you're sitting or standing up tall. This will help you feel more confident and in control. Additionally, aim to use your voice and express yourself clearly when you speak up and make your voice heard. It helps you to build your confidence. Always know that you have a valuable voice that needs to be heard. Don't be afraid to share your opinions. A confident woman hold her head high. Even when you're feeling a little wobbly. Hamadi recommends using your body language to convey the opposite stand up straight. Hold your head high, ground yourself and just look the part. A confident woman dress the part of a confident woman. Our clothes can actually increase our confidence when we feel good in them. Notes Hamadi. Think about how you feel. When you go to a job interview in a nice suit, dress for the job you want. Confident women don't care about labels or logos, but create their own style and aesthetic, says Eileen Scully, founder of the Rising Tides and author of In the Company of Men. Scully focuses on advancing women in the workplace through her work and as an international keynote speaker. She frequently labels don't make or state whom you are. But your confidence will bring nine at who you are from inside that dominates what is outside. Another habit of a confident woman is to be passionate. Being passionate about a subject will naturally increase your confidence, according to Hamadi. You can't be passionate and weak the two don't go together. Take care of your body and health when you feel and look good. You are more confident. The male clinic recommends harnessing the power of your thoughts and actions to raise your Self-esteem practicing regular self-care and safeguarding your mental health are too important. Steps in building and main. Maintaining self-confidence. As are getting enough sleep and exercise. A confident woman spend more time with other confident women. They don't joke with this. Surrounding yourself with positive people can boost your self-esteem and in turn your self-confidence. You will feel empowered around like-minded people, says Hamadi. Try new things. It's very empowering and exciting to try out the unknown, says Hamani. Once you've done so many things, you will feel more confident and can discuss them from experience. Be fearless and bold taking risks is part of being confident. As Adele says, be brave and fearless to know that even if you do make a wrong decision, you're making it for good reason. Facing your fears is a research-backed way to boost your self-confidence. Romanticize the ideal version of you from childhood. Many girls learn to romanticize their future partner or wedding. They visualize their wedding dress, their hair, the venue, and their lover. What if you applied this same concept to visualizing the ideal version of yourself to become the best table of contents? Confidence is one of the most important qualities we can cultivate. Confident women are more influential, more successful in the workplace, and lead happier lives. But how do we do it? Radical confidence. We went to the true expert in radical confidence, Lisa. Bilyu, Shikofu. Compete with yourself instead of comparing to others. Many insecurities are rooted in comparison, but external comparisons are only surface level. Analyzing yourself based on somebody else's external achievements won't bring you the lasting. Confidence you crave. Instead, try to focus on what Warren. Warren Buffet calls the inner scorecard. Confidence is one of the most important qualities we can cultivate. Confident women are more influential, more successful in the workplace, and lead happier lives.